guys, what's up? It is Preach as always. So today's video is going to be a short one, but I want to discuss an important issue with Modern Warfare 2019 that I'm afraid may hurt Modern Warfare 2 as well. But before we get into the problem, if you enjoy this video, smash the like button, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and turn the bell notifications on so you can see every time I post a new video. All right, let's talk about this issue. In every Call of Duty, we're given camo challenges to grind out on every weapon. But there is one particular category of challenges in Modern Warfare 19 that has not been in any other Call of Duty to my knowledge, and that is the Mounted Kills Camo Challenge. So you're going to notice in the background gameplay, I'm on a lot of corners as I come to them in this gameplay because I was trying to finish up this challenge on the MP5, which is a gun that this challenge really makes no sense with. In MW19, to complete any gun, you had to get 50 mounted kills with that weapon, and that challenge only opens up after you've leveled up your gun quite a ways. For those that have a camp-heavy playstyle, this might be something that can be accomplished naturally, and with it only being 50 kills per gun, it doesn't really seem all that bad, but it causes a problem within the gameplay itself. I'm sure you're asking, how can a camo challenge cause an issue within an entire match? Let me explain. When people who do not normally play in a slow or camp-heavy manner are having to mount to get kills, and then they have teammates who are already slower players, it can bring the flow of an entire match to a screeching halt. In my experience with Modern Warfare 19, I've had more games end on the time limit than with any other Call of Duty. And while a lot of that's map design of rooms and doors and windows and dark corners, I believe forcing players to go for mounted kills has made the problem so much worse. I had a great solution presented to me by my friend Seanathan, whose channel is going to be linked in the description below. Sean suggested they make mounted challenges weapon specific. So LMGs are literally meant to be mounted. So if you want to make a mounted challenge for those, great. But within the style of Call of Duty and in real life, SMG usage is just not practical or efficient as a mounted weapon and would never be your choice in that situation. I'd like to point out that this video is not me asking them to do away with the mounting mechanic, although I would not be opposed to that at all. Just remove the challenges that force people to play in that style. It's actively slowing down gameplay for everyone, and nobody likes matches that end on the time limit instead of the kill or the score limit. Infinity Ward, I beg you, if you've put these challenges into MW2 already, please just remove them. Well, that about wraps it up for this video. I'm going to let you watch out the rest of this gameplay as, after I finish with this commentary. But if you have an opinion on camo challenges and how they should be handled, let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe on this video, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Preach out. This was pretty gross. 